Today's 10 second video is brought to you by... Alright, seriously, how many of you want to pull random videos from a folder to a media source in OBS? How many of you found the way to do it, but it won't work with WebSocket version 5, and were told that you needed to change over to WebSocket 4.9 compatibility? Well, you don't, and guess what? I'm gonna show you how to set it up for WebSocket 5. Yay! The crowd goes insane, storms the field, and starts a riot. All right, so randomly, I wanted to do this months ago just because, and I couldn't get it to work with the new WebSocket, and I only found one video from a person on the subject, and all they did was say, it still works. And then in the description, it said, must be on WebSocket 4.9 compatibility. And that just doesn't cut it for me, you know? So I spent an hour working this out, and then I couldn't get it, so I reached out to Rondi and Tommy in the StreamerBot Discord, and Hustle Crow in the Jeefbird's pool of goaded people, and together, we made this work. Spoiler alert, it's an underscore, not a dash. That isn't gonna make sense to anybody, but if you had been there, you would get it, and I'm putting it in this video for the few people that watched me struggle bust the hell out of this on stream, only to realize that my raw code had a dash where I needed an underscore. It was a whole thing. Anyway, let's just do this, okay? Yeah, you're welcome, Frankie. First thing you need to do is open OBS and create a new scene named random videos and then add a media source named random video player and then just hit okay without touching any of the sources settings that's it obs done next open up streamer bot and create an action and name it chief bird what a guy or random video from folder whichever in the sub actions box you're gonna right click and go to core Hover over arguments and select set argument. In the variable name, write video folder, lowercase v, capital F. It has to be written that way, all right? For the value, write in the location of your folder you want to pull videos from and make sure to double up all of the backslashes. It's important. And then hit OK. Next. You want to right click, go to core, hover over C sharp and select execute C sharp code. In there, you're gonna copy and paste the code from the description below because no way am I going to make you type out the code. The last thing you need to do is set some OBS raw code and guess what? Yeah, that's it's in the description too. You just find it down there. What a fucking guy. So right click, hover over OBS and select raw in your sub actions list. And then in the raw, just copy and paste the raw code from the description below and then celebrate because that is literally it. Add a test trigger or a command trigger and then send me a medal of dopeness because you're done. It's done. You set it up. Go. If you loved this video and my amazing personality, please like the video and subscribe to the channel because I'll be here doing great shit like this all year. If you have any questions, requests, or love you want to share with me, please leave a comment below or jump into a live stream. I go live on Twitch every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 11-ish a.m. Central. Thank you all so much for watching, encouraging me to keep doing things like this, and motivating me to put pants on every day. Yeah, you're amazing. Hope you all have a great rest of your day. Take care, stay safe, and I hope to see you in the next video. Nailed it.